All right, I uh, added the little generator coils to my little um, dynamo and uh, played around with that a lot yesterday. And then uh, Dr. Stifler is getting ready to uh, post a new uh, circuit on the high voltage from thin air uh, thread at the overunity.com. So I'm going to be shifting my focus from the Mueller dynamo. Actually, it's uh, Muller is how it's pronounced. Uh, Carmen, if you watch my videos, I apologize for mispronouncing your last name. It's, it's Muller. And uh, the study of your dad's dynamo was fascinating to me. But I am going to shift over to Dr. Stifler's uh, work at this time. But I want to show you this. This is the voltage on this uh, capacitor right here, that super cap, at uh, about half a volt. And you see how it's dropping down. And uh, there's a LED on right now. And then over here on the uh, generator coil circuit, uh, my load is another uh, jewel thief circuit that uh, I can power up uh, off of uh, the generator circuit that's uh, looped back into the main circuit here on uh, the Muller. And uh, I went back into it um, at the positive rail of the super cap. And then on the other side of the uh, uh, 25 ohm rheostat where it enters the circuit so there's like a, a gap between the super cap and where I feed back in and that might be part of the secret to the Ramiro I don't know the study of the Ramiro was fascinating but uh, today I'm going to like I say shift back to Dr. Stifler's work and this is uh, a board that uh, from Dr. Stifler, it's a SEC 18-X exciter by Donald, Dr. Ronald Stifler. And uh, I'm going to run this off a 12-volt battery, and I'm going to take the energy coming off this, and I'm going to feed that through one wire into the Muller. And uh, you're going to watch this uh, cap voltage uh, go up uh, when I start the, the uh, dynamo up. Uh, by the way, my, my particular one was a 5 magnet, 4 pair of coil arrangement. And uh, I just put uh, 3 pairs on it um, as the testing unit. So let me start this up. Like I say, it's only at uh, half a volt here. You'll see this start to drop the minute I fire this off. There it goes. There goes the energy draining out of this supercapacitor to run the dynamo. You see it running around there. But I'm also, I'm generating uh, power now too. And uh, like I say, I'm, I'm feeding part of it back in. That's basically my load right there. Now what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn the exciter on. And you're going to see this drop down and it's going to go back up again. I'm going to hook this on here. Okay, now the exciter is on. And like I say, this is Dr. Stifler. This is a pure Dr. Stifler board with his name on it. It's even dated. And uh, to me, it's rather valuable. I'm not going to run this too long because it does heat up the transistor right here. But now I'm feeding energy back into the, the uh, mower. And you can see this uh, voltage start to climb back up again here. And so what I'm doing is I'm adding energy through one wire. This is a one wire feed back into the Mueller dynamo, Mueller dynamo. And uh, you can see I got this action going on here too. This is just uh, one little uh, thin wire hooked into the generator prototype board and I got that going on. Plus the uh, whole environment around this thing becomes excited and I've always thought this was such a fascinating thing about these uh, SEC exciters is the ability to excite the entire field around them and uh, everything's hot. So I've got a hot Muller, <laughs> hot Muller dynamo here. Anyway, I just wanted to share that with folks that that's what I'm up to. I'm working on this uh, Muller dynamo and uh, today I, I wanted to show that you can feed it with a one wire feed to an what's it called an Evan Minkle plug. It's two diodes hooked up to the input leads and then it just joined down here and it feeds in uh, from the exciter.
Okay, thanks for watching. The uh, work is going to be going on now over at the Dr. Stifler thread at the high voltage from thin air. Thanks.